I know it's been a long time and yeah I, I'll come up with the bullshit excuses why I haven't uploaded in a while anyways you know it's a bit late but here's the video you know we're comparing Forza vs GT if you're new to the channel I do this impulsively no script I just ran and I did tweet that this is Gran Turismo's worst model I have observed while Forza's is the best model I've observed in Forza it, at first that's because what you're looking at now is the car in the showroom and I thought they've done a really good job for you know it's surprising and it's surprising that Forza's done a good job this time around so I thought but you know a lot of people was like how can you say GT looks bad I'm not I, I wasn't saying Gran Turismo looks bad I was saying this is the worst model I've observed in Gran Turismo because it has some imperfections and that is a very rare moment in GT history for me. You know, I check out every car and this is the first car. It's got imperfections and I'll show you what I mean. If you look at the headlight right now on the front, the right headlight, it's like the lights clipping in with the bodywork, like the mesh is not correct. You know, so that's why my opinion, I said, this is Gran Turismo's worst car against one of Forza's best looking cars. Like you've seen in the clip when I was looking at the showroom of this version of the car, I thought, fuck, they finally made a good car. Are we gonna have a car that matches GT? I guess we'll find out. So we'll move on to the macro detail now. And you know, we're gonna check out all the smaller in intricate details. And you know, there's a lot of geometry problems in Forza as always. And you don't hardly see that in GT, but it is evident. And that's why I said this is one of Gran Turismo's worst looking cars I've seen but yet it's still running rings around Forza and I know you know I mean a lot of people like it doesn't really matter and it does matter because look at that text on the the rear lights there on Gran Turismo you know Forza's car looks like what the car is supposed to look like GT's cars is what the car looks like that's the difference and like you say a lot of people will be like ah it's about the physics it's just driving I'm not going to be zooming in well some of us do end of you know game offer you a showroom or photo mode to check out the cars get some nice photos for a reason anyways let's move into the showroom but fuck me bro this guy shut the fuck up like oh you don't know how many times this guy is just fucking at me and he's apologized so many times i almost could make a fucking video out of it but he's saying i'm not uploading brands hatch and i'm not going to upload this video because the car and the brands hatch is better in Forza, and i don't want to make gt look bad i've made gt look bad a few times but listen no it's not fucking that you stupid little prick how many times have i said and i said on twitter and i said in discord and i've spoke to a few of my viewers and two terabytes of fucking videos corrupted my hard drive corrupted i went out and had to buy another hard drive and start fresh because you know i was trying to schedule videos i was trying to make a month worth of content so i don't have to like today i'm making a video right now today the 24th i make them on the spot and you know it, it's hard because i don't have time and so i was making a month worth of videos so i could schedule it and i lost the fuck the, the files corrupted i don't know what it was like i said i almost quit youtube it pissed me off so and not only that i messaged the people who race on that track in real life so i can use the footage online and i have to wait for replies because i can't just use the footage and you know I, I put a load of footage together i've lost it it's just starting it again you know i, I have a life and you got to understand i was doing this because i've got a i've got a two daughters two and four i work nights our last works in the day so i have the kids in the day then i work nights and plus then i've got a second job what i've just took and i work on the weekends doing delivery as well as my other job so i have no time to myself it's just when as and when i can make videos it's just impossible the girls were all over they're fucking jumping all over me fucking fighting me playing on the playstation shouting me it's impossible to make a game and it's in the uk and we've just got summer so i have to capitalize when we get two hot days it's like fuck yeah this is probably the only two hot days we're gonna get let's take them to the beach so i have to do you know i haven't got time and plus you know i'm i'm also making a game running trying trying to run a game studio that i've set up and the bit of time i did kind of have i've i've been playing once human i haven't sat down and enjoyed the game for ages car games it's all the same yeah i enjoy them all the time but i just, I just had that break i enjoyed i enjoyed once human so let me know if you'd like me to upload this footage away you know games away from car games and um, because i was planning on to and yeah i've really enjoyed once human so i've sat on that i don't know if i've said everything but 
bro, no, the car's not better. No, the track's not better. It's close. And, you know, it's, there's a lot of things to go on. Just, just, just shut the fuck up, bro. Like, just fucking go and sit on, go and sit on a fucking spoon. You fucking bell end. I've got a life. I wish I could upload. I just can't, you know, it's just my time zones. I can't rely on YouTube as my income because it just doesn't work like that at the minute. And any bit of income I do, I'm putting it back into the channel or into the studio. So, you know, just fucking shrivel on that, you stupid cunt. I haven't really spoke much about the car because this is what happens when I don't script my commentary. I mean, I put the video together and then I commentate. That's how I go with the flow. I just fucking, you know, you never know what you're going to get with me. That's the whole point of this video episode, you could say, series, whatever we do with car comparisons. I don't script it. I just rant, say my mind, and that can fucking piss me off. So, yeah, I apologize for that. But as you can see, we're inside the car, and it's always got that chef's kiss when you can light up the dashboard, even your windows. Everything lights up like it should do, and that is just, like I say, it's like the chef's kiss when you're checking out these cars. It's just a good feature. And yeah, so what we're gonna do is we'll check out Forza's car as well and you can observe and tell me which car is better on the interior as well. Obviously I'm gonna pick GT and therefore that guy who's saying I didn't wanna upload this video because Forza's is better. I don't know what fucking car you're looking at bro. What Forza are you playing? You must be playing the same Forza that the Twitter account, the official Twitter account Forza people are playing because it looks nothing like what you're fucking saying in my in in my eyes, like in, right in front of me. You know, it just don't look like better than GT, it fucking done. But in the showroom, as I said, and I did say, I'll give credit where credit's due, the Forza showroom version of this car is one of the, one of the best I've looked at in Forza in Forza. Nothing compared to GT, but it's good. And when we get to the engine bay, you know, it actually, they've done a really good job. It looks like it's newly modeled. I don't know if, you know, if it's a, if the car's been you know, copy and pasted from another Forza. Um, I can't remember seeing this car in Forza 5 or Forza 6. I don't know. I just can't remember. I haven't looked at it. But yeah, it's one of the best cars they've made. And the engine bay, it's really detailed. And I'll show you, you know, you can see all the text. It's all sharp and crisp. It's not blurry. Maybe it's something to do with the updates, what they've, they've given us. Um, I don't know. But yeah, it does look a lot better, but not on GT's level. Another game I've been playing is called Exo Cross. I was playing it, I completed it when it was in early access. It was called Drag, and it's made by iRacing. So if you'd like me to upload that gameplay as well, if you want me to showcase that game, maybe you're interested in it, because maybe it gets, becomes competitive. It's like a realistic track mania, although the, now the game's just dropped. It dropped two days ago, well, last night. Well, now we're into 25th, because it's two o'clock in the morning. It dropped the other day and it feels a little bit more arcadey than it was originally but yeah it's it's weird it's it's like like i said it's like track mania but realistic and it's you're racing on exile planets and stuff like that because the story of it is basically you know we're in the future no one knows what it was like to drive petrol cars or cars with wheels back then so they found a planet made some fucking race tracks on it and the race you race and set times that's basically it um so let me know if I, if you'd like me to upload fucking heads gone blank and remember remember i didn't opt out i opt for maybe scripting my videos because when i make a mistake the rules are i don't cut it i just keep it in <laughs> in the video that's just the way it works and you know it's funny when i trip over my words i can't think my brain's not thinking i'm talking at 200 miles an hour and sometimes it's a messy commentary but i must keep my word and i'll fucking stick to it so i do apologize about that but look at the engine bay yeah it it's really fucking nice it looks good the textures seem good it looks really sharp and crisp I feel like it's a new model, I'm not too sure. But yeah, the details are there. It's not the best, but it's good. It could be better, but it doesn't need to be. I think this is fine. It, it looks really nice. And this is where we come to that point where I said this was Forza's best model against GT's, one of its worst models because of all the imperfections I've seen on it. And I don't usually see that in Gran Turismo cars. And like I always say, the, the choice is 
do you want to explode your car so you can look at the engine, look through the boot, look in the back seats, or would you have rather have the VR feature? For me, it's a VR feature because not all Forza cars explode like this and not all of them look as good as this one. But I feel like the update, they've updated the graphics slightly. I'm not too sure, maybe. I, oh, it's just the better lighting, better texture. I don't fucking know. It, it's, it seems like it looks better now, but still, it's a piece of shit compared to what it should have been. We all know that. Um, that's what they get for, you know, being cheap and employing people on fucking 18 month contracts and then bringing in a new person. They have to learn and catch up with where the last person left off. Some shit I've read, some people have told me some shit as well, so. I don't know. This looks like it's floating, kind of. I don't know. Look at the interior. It's just fucking... You can't look at GT and look at this and think Forza's better. End of. It's just not there. It's got... It's fucking lifeless. It's like it's just been slapped together. That'll do. It just looks fucking shocking. Would you like me to upload other fucking games anyways? I'm, I'm really rushing right now. I don't know why I'm rushing. I'm in no rush. I'm quite stressed, to be honest, today, lads. Um, but I'm keeping my commentary right I think I'm just going to fucking leave it there because I can't think for shit it's half past two and I'll see you in the next one. Oh no I won't see you in the next one look at the state of that shit I, I did tweet Forza I said oh can we have VR but thinking about it you'd look down on that in VR and you'd feel like you're going to fucking cut your fingers on that shit it's just so cheap and shit I know you're not going to be looking at it but you have got a showroom and you're letting me zoom in on it for a reason so at least fucking make it look like the actual car not not like a fucking toy car, you know what I mean? That's what I'm saying. Bosh, Please see you in the next one. Give me a sign, a sign. I feel like I'm losing my mind. Is everybody in the world die? Please, Lord, give me a sign, a sign. I want to be the greatest Everybody on their face shit I look around and feel like everybody is the fakest I make this Every day and I'm impatient Hoping one day I blow up from the basement Statement The top is so vacant I don't hear shit that I think is amazing Waiting for my day when I'm playing Sold out shows for a thousand faces Hey, Give me that crown Get in my way and you'll be put down It ain't your place All this my town If I want that shit that I